All right, good day everyone. This is Athens Clark County Mayor Kelly Gertz coming to you on March 11th, 2021. Uh, and I'll be straight up with you. I am so glad we are coming out of winter. Uh, it is not my favorite time as the sun gets dim and we have so many of those dark and rainy days. Uh, it is not good for my heart and my mind. Um, for many years, I had an uncle who lived in Miami, and so a, a standing week on my calendar was to get the heck out of here and get down there where I could get a little bit of relief. And uh, fortunately, nature is bringing us that relief right now here in Athens, Georgia, as we're getting longer days and warmer weather. And so I hope you and your loved ones and your neighbors and your family are all enjoying this as much as I am. Uh, I was listening to the radio this morning and the announcer noted that uh, here on March 11th, 2020, the World Health Organization declared that we were in fact in the middle of a pandemic. And it's hard for me to believe it's been an entire year. Um, of course, on the other hand, it feels like it's been more than a year. And I think that year has taught us a whole lot about ourselves and our community and our ability to support each other and work together. And it's also taught us that it's a challenging time in which to get things done, you know, where we're not spending the informal time before meetings and uh, at lunchtime running into each other on the street and um, seeing each other in line for coffee in the morning. And so I, I'll tell you, I cannot wait to get back to that as more and more and more of us get vaccinated in the months and the weeks ahead. You probably have heard that the governor has just announced this week that there is an entire new set of folks who can become vaccinated in the time ahead, including all those age 55 and older. I'm not quite there yet. And those with some medical fragilities. So please look for information on our www.accgov.com slash coronavirus page about that information. Uh, we are also warmed this week to know that the American Rescue Plan Act has passed both houses of Congress and will be on the president's desk on Friday. And so as we understand it, athens Clark County will be receiving two deliveries this year and next year in the total amount of about $60 million. And these funds have to be spent in some designated ways. And I will be suggesting to you, the public, and to our county commission, and to our staff, that be, we be really thoughtful and focused about how we spend these funds. Uh, we, we don't want to relive one of those 70s or 80s shopping spree game shows where you see somebody running down the aisles grabbing Cocoa Puffs off the shelf by the armload. Um, I'll be suggesting that we spend these funds in a way that really creates foundational supports so that the dollars spent today have an impact a decade from now in a way that is truly going to make us resilient and more resistant to the challenges that we know we're going to face year in, year out. And so what I anticipate is that we are going to have some navigator supporters for you as a household and for your business or your operation so that you too can best access the funds that flow, not only through the unified government, but from the state and from the federal level as well. Um, we need to make this money count in a real solid way that's gonna be structurally supportive. I wanna mention a couple of things that you're gonna be seeing in the weeks ahead as well. Um, you may have heard that we do have some modest scale, small tens of thousands of dollars grants that we are gonna be providing to nonprofits and the deadline for that grant money is the 19th of March. And so uh, on the screen and in the paragraph below this video, you'll see more information about that. So if you work for or with a nonprofit, please apply for those grant funds for uh, expenditures of food, housing, and homeless service aid. I also wanna let you know that there is an arrest record restriction event coming up on April 17th but you have to register for that by March 29th. 
We, of course, have been working hard to work with our returning citizens who've been under supervision or under incarceration so that as you re-enter the community, you can do that in as whole a way as possible and live a better life today. So look for more information about that. And finally, athens Clark County has advanced in a competition called the Nope Competition, named for the character Leslie Nope from Parks and Recre Recreation, played by Amy Poehler. We are now in the Sweet 16 of National Water Facilities. So our Cedar Creek Water Reclamation Facility that has the 1.2 gigawatt per year solar array is our entry into that competition. And so I would ask you, as a member of the public, to make sure we get from the Sweet 16 into the final eight, the final four, the last two, and into the winning bid for that competition. And so you'll see more information on the screen and below. Um, can't wait to see you out on the street in the weeks ahead. Um, I'm hoping for the best for you and for all of us. And I can't thank you enough for being such a great part of the athens Clark County community.